This is the Samsung Galaxy A15. So I got a comment on TikTok to do a speed test on the 5G plus Wi-Fi because a lot of you guys are reporting it's slow, which I've done my tests and yes, it is slow. And I did some research on the Wi-Fi. It looks like this phone is running Wi-Fi 2 from 1999, but it can't be Wi-Fi 2 because I did some speed tests and it can get up to about a max, a max speed of 302. One megabits per second. Now I have a 500 megabit download connection on Wi-Fi, so I know there's something going on. Um, so I'm not too sure what Wi-Fi it is, but if you Google the stats on the Samsung website, I'm pretty sure it's Wi-Fi 2. But Wi-Fi 2 should only have a capacity of 54 megabits, so not sure how it's able to achieve uh, 300. But yes, I'm going to just show you a speed test. So let's um, connect to the Wi-Fi first, and um. She was speed test, so I'm now on the 500 uh, megabit connection. Now I'm going to do a comparison on the Galaxy 23 to show you the difference. So let's first of all open the speed test. On uh, this is going to be the Samsung A15, the budget phone. Um, you can pick these up for about $300 or get them through Optus for about a dollar a month. Pretty cheap. So first of all, let's do a speed test. Hopefully you guys can see that okay. So as you see right here, again, like if you're not really caring how fast the internet is, this thing can achieve, you know, up to 300 megabits on Wi-Fi. As you can see, it doesn't have any Wi-Fi 6 symbol at the top because that does ensure that we definitely are not running Wi-Fi 6 on this phone. So it looks like we're getting uh, 293 and we're getting 52.2 upload. Okay, so now let's change it to the Galaxy 23. Okay, let's go change it and then we're going to do a 5G speed test, just what you guys have asked for. Now if you want us to do anything else on the Galaxy uh, A15 5G, let us know. It can be anything, you name it. Anything you want us to do on that phone, let us know and we'll definitely do it. Because I can kind of compare it with the Galaxy 23. So this is the Galaxy 23, we are now on Wi-Fi and you'll actually notice now it is saying Wi-Fi 6, okay? So let's do a speed test and see the difference. So it's running a little slower than normal, but it's nearly achieving the 500 meg connection. Yep, and then let's see what our upload can get to. All right, so let's just compare the difference. This one is your A15, this one on the left hand side. So you can see the difference, so budget phone is a little slower than the Galaxy 23 in Wi-Fi speed. Now let's compare 5G. Now I'm using the same network by the way, I'm not switching down the network, we're using the Optus 5G network. We're going to start off with the A15, which is the title of this video, and then we will continue it with the Samsung 23, S23, and see which one is in fact faster. Which, um, like the A15 can get pretty all right speeds sometimes. Sometimes it's really bad, I will admit, it's super bad. But we, we will just reboot that app quickly. Okay, so I've just reopened the app. This is the A15 in front of me, just in case you guys aren't sure. Okay, and you can see we are on 5G and the bars are pretty good. Let's go do a speed test. So as you see, it's a bit sluggish at the moment. Getting 35 megabits on a 5G network. Now I can, I have got it higher than this, so I am gonna do a second speed test. Okay, just to reboot everything, I'm just gonna chuck this phone on airplane mode and then pull it off and reconnect to the network. Okay, uh, and then we'll just do another speed test. Yep, we're back on 5G, let's go. 
So very bad connection, 43 megabits per second on fire. Okay, so here we go. Getting better. So we're on 5G and we're achieving 100 and roughly 40 megabits per second nearly. So we got 139 and upload is obviously gonna be around potentially 40 or 35. 33, that is the 5G speed. Now I have got it better. I have got it a bit higher than that before, okay? Um, I don't wanna really say too many numbers, but just in case you guys can't get it, but I have got it up to around 300 MPS. Uh, I have got a little higher than that also when I've been walking around the city. Can get it a bit higher, but that's what I'm currently getting at the moment. Now let's show you what it should be getting by opening the Galaxy 23. So we'll just reboot the app again. Okay, so we're good to go. Let's see what the Galaxy 23 can achieve. As you see, it's already beating it by a lot. And we're gonna do the same thing, knock it on airplane mode and then turn it back off. That sometimes refreshes the connection and makes it a bit faster. So we are gonna do that. So we've got 377 here. And then once that's gone through its upload again, we will reboot it, um, just put it on airplane mode and see if that fixes anything. So uh, 377 and 35. Let's try again. So, you can definitely see there is differences with budget phones. Again, I'm not getting into all the budget th features on obviously the Galaxy A15, but you can definitely see within speed, if you want 2024 speeds, it ain't gonna be achieved on the A15, okay? Um, it just cannot be achieved. Like, it is a lot slower, okay? But again, it'll still do everyday needs. Like, you can get up to 300 megabits per second on Wi-Fi, pretty good. So that's basically the video that you guys requested about the A15. So we've done a Wi-Fi speed test and also a 5G speed test. If there's anything else you want us to look into on the A15, be sure to let us know. But that's gonna be everything in today's video and we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for requesting the video.